Hello everyone, my name is Trooper, and welcome back to a, another video. Today I'm going to show you guys how to install some custom vehicles and mods into your guys' Beam NG MP server. If you guys do need to set up a Beam MP server, then make sure you guys first of all check out my first video on setting a Beam MP server, then the second one on port forwarding. And if you guys are planning a Beam MP server with a massive community, then I use a server host and I offer my own server hosting on my website, hdnetwork.1, down in the description below. All you need to do, come on over to the server hosting page or just click server hosting right here and select the Gameflex Windows VPS, which is designed perfectly for literally any game server. So Minecraft, 5M or BeamNP, it will work perfectly. But all you guys want to do is add it to your cart, check out, and once you guys have got that, you'll be given remote login details, which look a little bit like this. It's literally a complete virtual Windows PC and is a lot more safe than using your own PC to host since it masks your IP and it doesn't put you at risk for DDoSing attacks, which home hosting does. Obviously, if you're playing with friends, it doesn't really matter. But if you're playing with random people, they could find you where you live and then DDoS you. Not the best idea. But as I showed you guys in the other video how to make the BeamMP server, we're just going to open that BeamMP server folder on up. Here it is. Going to go inside of the resources folder and inside of the client folder right here and now this is where we're going to put all of our mods including the vehicles so i'm going to be showing you guys how to install vehicles today i usually download from the official beamng forums because there are some other websites out there where you can get branded vehicles maybe like a lamborghini or something which beammp doesn't allow or beamng doesn't allow on their website but the websites on here are guaranteed to not give you a virus and they are still really really high quality these are my two favorite right here the Hiroshi CCF, which is like a Mazda MX-5 BMW Z4 sort of thing. So we're going to download that. And also this one right here, 2022 Pryson or Pryken Century. It's also really, really high quality. So we're going to download both of these today. So just click the first link down in the description below, which will take you to the Hiroshi CCF. And click download now. So download it in a zip. So make sure you guys do have a zip opener like WinRAR. And once it's done, we're just going to open it on up in the folder locations. Click the little folder next to it. And all you need to do is grab that download folder, the whole zip, and we're going to just drag and drop it into the client folder, just like that. Super simple and easy. And we're going to install the next one. So just go back and hit the next link down in the description below to bring you guys to the Centuri. And we're going to do the same thing. Hit download now. And it will start downloading the mod for us. And we're pretty much going to do the exact same steps. So once it's finished downloading in a couple of seconds here, all you need to do is just drag and drop it from the folder of our downloads and in to the client folder. And now to actually get these loaded into our game, all we need to do is if your server is already started, just close it and then just double click to start it on up again. And you guys should see it's loaded two mods. That's how you guys know it has worked. And because in the last video, I port forwarded on the VPS, making sure we're nice and safe using not our own IP, using a HD network VPS. We are good to join our server and actually use our new mods. There we go. We can come on over to the direct connect or just the public servers and search for your server name. I'm just going to paste in the IP of the VPS. And since it's a VPS, not my own IP, it literally doesn't matter. Just click connect and you guys can see it's going to start downloading our new mods for us. So we don't have to actually install them on our side. As soon as we join the server, it will download them into our game for us. And once you've loaded into your server, all we need to do is hit the pause button and go to vehicles. And there you guys go. You can see that the mods have installed. So just pick anyone you want and just replace current, spawn it on in, and you guys should be able to see the new vehicle mod we've just added. There you guys go. Actually, really, really simple to install mods into BeamMP. You guys do need to set up your own BeamMP server and you don't want to do it using your own IP address because you don't want to put yourself at risk of DDoS attacks and being tracked by random people. Then be sure to check out my website, hdnetwork.1, down in the description below where we offer pretty competitive and really, really high performance VPSs for pretty low costs in comparison to other server hosts. So we offer a lot better CPUs, about 200 times faster than pretty much any other competitor. So be sure to check that out down in the description below and I'll see all of you guys in the next video. Cheers and goodbye.